Good morning, everybody. Good evening. Good night, uh, wherever you are. Good afternoon. Thank you for joining uh, me today on this historic day. It's a very important uh, day for uh, all of us because we are doing something amazing for uh, Sanatan Dharma. To that effect, um, I won't take much of your time and let's start with a small uh, invocation of Lord Ganesha and then I will get straight into it. Vakratunda Mahakaya Surya Koti Samaprabha Nirviganam Kurume De Sarvakarashu Sarvada I offer my obeisance to the divine in you with whose grace we are all here right now, this moment. And as I said, thank you very much for uh, joining me today. It means a lot that all of you from different parts of the world uh, have come online. And as you may be aware that I am going to share something quite amazing with you. Uh, we have worked very hard on this thing over the last two years. But more importantly, I feel this could be the turning point for a lot of seekers who wish to connect with the divinity within and without. <clears throat> and today also happens to be Mahashivratri, Har Har Mahadev. It, we could not have picked a, a better day to um, launch our sadhana app. So if you please allow me, I'm going to share my screen uh, with you. This is my study den, by the way, uh, in the ashram. I'm going to share my screen with you and then um, we'll go from there. Just give me a moment. Um... Okay, so um, I hope all of you can uh, see my screen and, and hear uh, the audio uh, in the app. Uh, some of you have been very eager, more eager than I am, uh, as I understand uh, tens of people already uh, downloaded the app as soon as it became available. So I think um, that's good, but that means uh, no surprise for you, you already know what's in it. But for all the rest who haven't, uh, I'm sure uh, I'm confident you will enjoy. So uh, without further ado, let me enter uh, straight into the app. Now you may see me um, looking down all the time. That's because uh, I'm offering obeisance to you and also have to look at the screen. <laughs> the, um, because I'm using my phone, I'm sharing my screen with you. <clears throat> so when you enter into this app, uh, staying true to the spirit of Sanatan Dharma, um, I've not really created a path for you. I'm not suggesting that one way is better than the other or one form is better than the other. You can connect with whomever you like, whenever you like. So when you first enter, you see this map. If you tap on the leftmost corner, you can see the deities uh, with their name. Or if you tap again, you will see the temples. Now you see this um, lotus uh, bobbing up and down somewhere uh, here close to this. You can, this is your home uh, hut. You can start from this location or you can go to any temple directly. So uh, once again, keeping, staying true to the spirit of uh, Sanatana Dharma, what I will do uh, in this app, you can do Japa, which is chanting, Yajna which is fire offerings, or you can do Abhishekam, which is anointment, anointing the Lord with various ingredients or kind of coronation. And you can also do daily worship, which is Nitya Puja. So I am going to uh, start with a Japa. So I am thinking that today in this uh, launch on this auspicious day of Mahashivratri, we'll do one Japa, one Yajna, one Puja, and... Um, one Abhishekam as well as one brief sadhana, uh, which means I hope you've set aside the four hours of your time. Uh, just joking, it won't take four hours. Uh, perhaps uh, 
less than an hour all up maybe even less so when you tap on a temple uh, you see the exterior of the temple and as i've shared earlier we worked relentlessly hard over the last two years assembling the best of the best uh, in the industry and outside the industry to uh, really create or recreate actually the beauty and the glory of the ancient vedic culture so this particular location is called gajkarna if you tap on the right bottom you can see uh, on the eye icon what it is about and as i shared this app is going to be eternally free so when you tap on that lotus you see these options you can do one of these as i said we'll start with the japa of lord ganesha when you enter you see these various mantras you can tap on the eye icon to know more about it maybe i'll just do it here quickly so it tells you the mantra and what it is if you have selected uh, hindi everything will be shown in hindi uh, if you select english it'll all be in english uh, not to mention you can also know what the benefit of chanting any particular um, not mantra but why do we chant for example if you tap on the play icon here um, a character ved vyasa will come up and will tell you the importance the of simple but effective doing practice chanting. chanting a mantra so i i will skip it for now because this is something you can explore on your, um, on your own once again both in hindi and english now once you tap it takes you inside now you have two ways to do a japa you can do it with timer or you can do it with counter so let's say we'll do it with counter you can select a standard counter or you can just type whatever you like so i'm just going to say let's say 11 times because all of you are eager seekers i don't want to take more time than absolutely necessary <clears throat> so now <clears throat> i hope you can um, hear the chanting of the mantra so i can just swipe down uh, it it kind of um, imitates a, a real chanting what you can also do is tap here and turn off the sound so if you just want to if you know the mantra you're chanting you don't want me chanting with you you can just chant at your own pace however you like or you can just do this uh, the sound again om gangana patai namah 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 Now the door uh, will open for each location um we have a different uh, obviously deity I love this. So we have uh, licensed music and different So now if you want you can hear the whole thing or you can just skip. <clears throat> so I'm going to skip just after a few seconds. I've tried my best to create an environment as real as possible. When you are done, it shows you and it takes you to this screen. So obviously I'm just going to say no thank you, but if you say no thank you, then I'd like you to wait 10 seconds uh because this app is going to be totally free, but to have a world class team uh costs money. Now after doing that japa uh let's do one yagya fire offerings at lord shiva because today is mahashivaratri
so the beauty here is that you can do um, pretty much all the rituals are available between four and like 20 minutes so when you don't have much time you can do a brief yoga it only takes four minutes This is Kailasha. <laughs> so you will see this screen first and you tap. And when you tap, the yagya starts. Oh, and the labels are in wow. Hindi here. I changed it, so I'm just going to change it to English. And you can obviously... Um, so at the bottom, you see two ingredients, ghee and firewood. They are always there. The top two are what uh, they keep changing based on where you are in the yagya. So the first few offerings are only with ghee. So I'm just going to offer when you offer. That helps. How it goes. You've used the uh, particle um, engine and physics, real gravity here. So when the ingredients actually go in, it's very much real time. You can offer firewood anytime you like. And you can offer ghee anytime you like. Because you want to keep the fire going, right? And then... So you see these little radial uh, bars going around. So that's when an ingredient becomes available. It becomes fully visible. Until then, it remains grayed out. And this is a phenomenon you will see throughout the app in various rituals as well. Om Namo Bhagavate Rudraya Om Swaha The mantra in this particular uh, yagna is a bit short and that's why you see the ingredients appearing pretty fast. Om Swaha Om Namo Bhagavate Rudraya Om Swaha Om Namo Bhagavate Rudraya so just, uh, I'm sure you might have figured out by now, but I am actually tapping on these ingredients to offer. If I don't tap, they don't get offered. The chanting of the mantras in the background continues to go. So this is four minutes long, as you know. So if you don't mind, we'll do the whole four minutes. And if you do mind, then we will definitely do the whole four minutes. Om Swaha Om Namo Bhagavate Rudraya Om Swaha Om The ingredients as you see they they are offered like you would experience in real life Om Bhagavate Rudraya Om Swaha Om Tat Purushaya Vidmahe Mahadevaya Dhimahi Tanno Rudraha Prachodayat Om Swaha in most of the Gayatri chanting that you uh, hear uh, of various deities, in the end it should be Daya Aat. But I have not followed that convention. To keep it utterly simple, I've just uh, chanted the way um, I thought would be easiest for everybody. Now, when we offer the Purnahuti, the final Purnam offering, Purnam which is happening Purnam now with coconut. Um, and then we are going to Om offer, uh, which is usually Shanti. Vasodhara. It's done with uh, ghee. But uh, in some schools of thought, you also offer rice pudding or paisam in the end. 
पूजा आराधन काले आगमनाय तिष्ट तिष्ट पर स्थाने स्वस्थाने परमेश्वर यत् ब्रह्मा देव देवा सर्वे तिष्ठन्ति मे हृदय So when the yajna ends, this is what transpires. This is Lord Shiva in his cave in Kailasha. This particular music uh, that you hear was uh, done by Manish Vyas and his team. So I'm going to skip it so we can move on. Namo Parvati Patae Har Har Mahadev. Now, once again, you will see this screen. You know, it was quite possible to disable this screen for regular users or donors and so on. But I wanted to stay true to the spirit of Sanatan Dharma, where a user has the option to give any dakshina if they so wish, because dakshina is not really donation. Dakshina is not dan. Dakshina is something we do or give after a ritual. So I thought at least let's keep the option there for everybody, regardless of uh, how involved they are in building the app or uh, spreading the cause of uh, dharma or doing sadhana. So now uh, we've done a yajna and we've done one uh, japa. Now, if you like. Let's do a um, brief Abhishekam. So if we go here and then we go here and let's do a brief one. So I was, as I was saying, we can actually change the uh, location. So earlier I did it in uh, Vedic forest, Vedaranya. This is Kailasha, this is Amravati, this is Gajkarna, this is Vaikuntha, this is Golden. Maybe let's do it here. And you can move around the scene or you can uh, obviously zoom. Every soundtrack that you hear, every chant you hear, um, we have licensed this painstakingly, contacting different creators and so on. Shastra, Lakat Pita, 
a beautiful melody. And you can zoom in. Now you can zoom out and see the, the Lord from different angles. It's one of the most beautiful things. So all that zooming in, zooming out, or moving, I'm actually doing this gesture on the screen. I'm sure you know by now, I'm actually sharing my screen, uh, phone screen with you. <laughs> so all of this is happening in real time. The good thing about that little interruption we had was uh, I got to do a full Abhishekam and now another one. Because we are doing the smaller uh, Abhishekam, in this one the offerings are less, so we haven't offered uh, Vastra or gold um, and stuff. I think you might have missed that in the earlier one when I did the elaborate one. When you offer gold, um, the Lord actually gets uh, adorned with various ornaments. So this is the completion of this Abhishekam. One of the things I was mentioning earlier is when I had the idea of this um, virtual world, this app two years ago, I wrote a 300 page spec um, indicating how the various temples should be like, where they would be situated, what's the flora fauna, the architecture, uh, what kind of climate, what kind of at what altitude uh, they are, and so on. And so now what we'll do is uh, we'll do one Nitya Puja daily worship, and I will take you to your home location. You can do it straight away, uh, straight from any temple as well, but you can also do it from your home location if you go here. So as I was saying, you can actually change this image, the altar. You can see it any deity. Let's say I see it, uh, Ganesha here. And let's do Nitya Puja. Let's say we do one of uh, Ma Lakshmi. We'll do a brief puja which is five offerings, um, Panchopchar as it's called. Then you have Shodashopchar, 16 offerings, which is a medium length puja. Then you have Chatur Vishanti, 24 offerings. You can turn on, turn off this lamp, by the way. And you have to, unlike Yagya Abhishekam um, and the other ritual Japa, you actually have to tap here to continue with the puja because this is immersive this is an immersive process 
interactive. So on the right you see this thing with the radial bar. So I'm actually tapping on them when it becomes available to do the puja. And you can move around the lamp and so on in this one. I'll just do it here. And you can actually, this is what I'm doing with my hands right now. You can tap and hold an ingredient and move it around wherever you like after it's been offered. So I've just kept it there. Vanaspati rasod bhuto gandadyo gandha uttamam agrahe sarvadevanam tupayom pratigrihatam om bhur bhava swaha mahalakshmai namah dupam samarpayami om suprakasho mahadipaha sarvatasti mirapaha So I've moved it here with my gesture and even this one you can actually revolve it or whatever you like, you can put it anywhere you like or you obviously you can leave it there. If I turn off the lamp, this is how it is. If I turn it on by tapping on the lamp on top, so, because we chose a uh, brief puja, this is only, I think, three, three and a half minutes. If you tap anywhere on the screen, you will see other options appear like settings or to pause or to go back. समर्प्यामि Mantrahinam Kriyahinam Bhaktihinam Sureshwara Yat Pujitam Maya Deva Paripurna Tadastume Yadakshra Padabrashtam Matrahinam Jayad Bhavet Tat Sarvam Kshamatam Deva Prasida Parameshwara My thought was that most of you are pressed for time because uh, there are a million things in life you are dealing with at any point in time. Plus, most people have to spend time on uh, YouTube and uh, Netflix and uh, WhatsApp and other things. So I thought there has to be a way that you can still do your daily worship and so on in just three to five minutes. So most of the rituals can be done that quickly. Now we are left with just uh, one key ritual um, in the app. And that is uh, sadhana. This was, this was why this app was even created at the first place. So I am, let's say, going to do Vedmata Gayatri's sadhana. Sadhana or Purush Charana is something you do over a period of time. So let's say, you'd say, um, and you choose every location has three sadhanas if for you. So let's say we go for uh, Savitur Gayatri, the famed uh, Gayatri Mantra. I hope it's not my internet. Something should come up. Hmm. We'll give it 10 more seconds. Okay, good. So when you start a sadhana, it obviously first tells you a little bit about uh, that sadhana and then you go next then you choose how many days you want to devote to this sadhana 
So 21, 40, let's say we just say 21. And I'm just going to go next. And how many minutes every day you will chant that mantra as part of your sadhana? So 30 minutes, uh, more or less the recommended. So let's say I'm just going to say one minute uh, for now. So that I can show. This is, uh, as you know, the importance of sankalpa, your vow, that why are you doing this sadhana? This is kind of your pact between um, you and the deity or the universe. So I'm just going to say, I am doing it to keep my users happy. Just joking. Uh, if I do good things for you, you will be happy, hopefully, for grace. So strictly That's adhering fine. to the uh, rituals Bring and the process of right. sadhana, when you go here, uh, right. it's called Dwar Puja. Like before you enter your puja griha, the before you enter your place of worship, this is Mother Goddess. And once again, this is a 3D scene that I'm zooming in, and you can zoom out, you can move around the scene. I'm I'm doing it with a swipe on my uh, this thing uh, phone, and if I zoom out. This is the whole scene, and I can zoom in. So at the bottom, it shows you if I tap at what day you are in. So day one of 21, number of steps. Don't be alarmed looking at the number of steps. It's um, really interactive. And for example, if in Yajna we are chanting the mantra 24 times, then they, for now, it counts each one as a step. In the subsequent Om releases, we will be Namaha. fixing that. Om so, it goes here. And you can turn Om off the audio Jyoti whenever you like Jyoti by tapping on this button. Swaha. And I've tapped it again. And you can, of course, Jyoti also change the language. All the language, let's say if I just go Jyoti Hindi. Suryaha. Then you see everything is being displayed in Hindi. I have made absolutely no compromises. You also see all the mudras uh, for various sadhanas. All you have to do is tap on each mudra and that becomes your offering for that mudra. I will change the language back to uh, English. Shriman Mahaganadhi Patay Namaha Om Prithvi Tvayadhrita Loka Devi Tum Vishnunadhrita Tum Chadhariya Mahadevi Pavitram Guru Chasanam Saptavyarti Nam Jamadagni Bhardwaj Atri Gautam Kashyap So the first uh, Avahan, Stapan, Avguntan and Sandirodhan, Sanidapan and so on. The 10 steps and then the Japa and then in Gayatri Sadhana there are 24 additional mudras, hand locks that are offered beforehand and uh, 8 after the Japa and all of that is doable here plus you have the option to do your yajna of that particular sadhana right here. It will, when it comes to that, it will ask you, do you want to do uh, yajna or not? If you do, you can do it right here. You don't have to leave this location. We are offering the various. Now we are doing nyasa, as you can see. This is Rishyadi nyasa. I've personally recorded the audio of um, each of the sadhanas. Uh, these are the sadhanas I've done um, in my life. So, kind of been there, done that. And I've chanted it in a way so that it's what you would normally do when you're doing your rituals uh, or when you're doing any Vedic. Puja, as opposed to when you do it in, uh, how to say, uh, there's this recitation, not exactly singing of the, the chants. 
यूजिष्यामि तवदेवी इहावत ओम भूर्भुव स्व श्री गायत्रे इहा गच्च इहा तिष्ट स्वयं महिमा मूर्ति स्वस्याम सर्वग प्रभो भक्ति स्नेह समाकृष्ट दीपवत स्थापम्यहम ओम भूर्भुव स्व श्री गायत्रे इह तिष्ट अस्मिन वरासने देवी so what i will do um, because this is fairly long this is another 18 to 20 minutes uh, i'm going to exit this rather than doing the whole thing so sanidhyam guru tasya obviously when you try to stop a sadhana midway it gives you a warning but let's say i do it anyway and then when you do it uh, you go back in there the next day because i haven't completed this whole step um, i thought you can do it on your own it will show you that you come back in another 24 hours so on the on top of the temple it will actually show you which day of the sadhana you are in and you also have um, like in in your settings i may as well quickly walk you through you can choose your altar um, so this is your profile uh, this is om swami in case you have noticed Uh, he couldn't be here today to uh, do the launch so instead i'm doing it now uh, you have your altar you can as i said set up first picture and second picture and language if i go hindi it immediately will turn everything um, uh, into hindi and uh, the sounds of the forest and so on you can turn on and turn off the sound of the chanting and haptic feedback which is vibration so if you have any questions on which sadhana should i do then you can go tap on this button and it will take you to a brief uh, questionnaire which helps you uh, you answer some questions and it guides you which sadhana you could start with uh, i won't go into that for now and then this is just a simple support screen tapping here you see your achievements what are the yagyas you have done how many times various mantras japas nitya pujas you see some are enabled and some are grayed out the ones that are grayed out are the ones you can do if you want to know for example what is this particular one the damru one it will tell you what this is and how much you've already done and then same for yagya and uh, various other rituals and you can also see leaderboard like who's doing uh, yesterday as i said <laughs> many eager people before i could do the launch today were eager to just uh, download and you can see who's doing it where and if you want to know you can tap uh, this is amrendra he is a physics professor lovely lovely soul now uh, if you tap you can see if they've done any ritual and if they have done any you see it here now of course you can go back and you can change your profile uh, this is om swami in case you haven't noticed uh, he couldn't be here today to uh, do the launch so instead i'm doing it now uh, you have your altar you can as i said set up first picture and second picture and language if i go hindi it immediately will turn everything um, uh, into hindi and uh, the sounds of the forest and so on you can turn on and turn off the sound of the chanting and haptic feedback which is vibration so if you have any questions on which sadhana should i do then you can go tap on this button and it will take you to a brief uh, questionnaire which helps you um, you answer some questions and it guides you which sadhana you could start with uh, i won't go into that for now and then this is just a simple support screen tapping here you see your achievements what are the yagyas you have done how many times various mantras japas nitya pujas you see some are enabled and some are grayed out the ones that are grayed out are the ones you can do if you want to know for example what is this particular one the damru one 
it will tell you what this is and how much you've already done. And then same for Yajna and uh, various other rituals. And you can also see leaderboard, like who's doing uh, yesterday, as I said, <laughs> many eager people before I could do the launch today were eager to just uh, download and you can see who's doing it, where, and if you want to know, you can tap. Uh, this is Amarendra, he's a physics professor. <laughs> lovely, lovely soul. Now, uh, if you tap, you can see if they've done any ritual. And if they have done any, you see it here. Now, of course, you can go back and you can change your profile to private, which means people won't see your details then. Or you can keep it public. And then we have Panchangam here. So in Panchangam, you can see today's uh, date or you can choose any date and just, uh, it will give you the calendar for that particular date for Titi, the lunar calendar, Panchangam and so on. Once again, everything available in Hindi and English. You can pick your city. This one it picked automatically. Let's say I picked Toronto. So, there you go, that's Toronto's uh, sunrise, sunset, and uh, so on. And yeah, that's it. So I'm going to stop the share now. So thank you very much for uh, joining me um, today, people. It uh, meant a lot that all of you came and uh, to watch this, uh, what to say, launch. Uh, I'm sorry about the uh, interruption we had uh, in the middle because uh, we are in the ashram, it's in, the, in a remote place. We have one cell phone tower, but I don't know what happened. Uh, it just, uh, you know, uh, went kaput. But whatever it is, um, it's right in front of you. So I hope you make the most of this app and really unleash the power of sadhana in your life to realize your potential to feel closer to god to divine to this beautiful divine energy that courses through this entire universe the one who develops a bond with the divine never feels lonely never feels alone i mean i'm not saying you won't have your sad moments i'm not saying you won't be upset or irritated or agitated uh, those things may still be there. But in all this, you will not lose your anchor. And if a ship has a strong anchor, it can weather the, the toughest and the hardest storms. So you need dharma as much as dharma needs you. And we all develop our coping mechanisms in life, you know. For some people, it's a cigarette. For some, it's a drink of some kind. For others, it's sometimes lashing out. Some people go silent. Some people go um, on a retail therapy. They'll go out and shop heavily. Some people will just binge watch Netflix or whatever. We all develop our coping mechanisms to avoid unpleasant or undesirable experiences in life. The beauty is those coping mechanisms, they don't have to be those that are detrimental to your mental and emotional and physical well-being. You can develop a divine, a beautiful, a sublime coping mechanism. And sadhana app is just one of those things. I mean, I have benefited so much with sadhana throughout my life. And when people would ask me questions and tell me that it's hard to do these steps, it's hard to do mudras and, and were the chanting and, and Sanskrit and so on. I, I didn't know how to help them beyond saying, look, I've already written it in a book. Now you just follow it. The app takes it a million times further because now you just have to tap, 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 and you are making the offerings to the divine and as I said, in the future releases, there are some many, many uh, more exciting things and useful things planned. 
Uh, also, please bear with us. Um, in the first month or so, you may see some bugs um, and things, but don't let the bugs bite you, okay? <laughs> so you may see some bugs and so on. Uh, this is what I call an MVP, a minimum viable product. So we will be improving it. Um, we will be uh, taking it much further. I can't reveal absolutely everything because uh, there are some amazing, useful things I've planned uh, that we would be building over the next uh, couple of years and beyond um, in this app. And as long as you devote even a few minutes every day, as you can see, most of the rituals can be done in three to five minutes, the brief ones. I think at least you will remain connected to dharma and that will become your coping mechanism that will become your anchor in life and when that happens you will feel immensely more empowered uh, in your life to do amazing things so i also wanted to thank you all for one more thing uh, many of you participated in our uh, fundraising which will now help us to go ahead and and build. Um, we will start building the Shri Chakranagar any day now after the launch. Uh, we've already commenced some work on other features. Uh, we have raised 55% of, um, of our uh, target. So a big applause to you all and thank you so much uh, because this helps me in hiring the best people. And you cannot do uh, an extraordinary job without having best people on board. So I wanted the glamour and the glory of Sanatan Dharma to come alive. And you can't do that with interns. You can't do that with inexperienced developers and artists and illustrators to do justice to the beauty and the vastness of <clears throat> our Vedas. We needed people equally good. And, <clears throat> excuse me, they are, they are spread throughout the world. So I wanted to thank you for participating. Um, time and again, you surprise me with your love for me, with how much faith you have uh, in me and how much you trust me. And I want you to know that is my anchor in life. You will never ever feel that you put your trust in the wrong person because I may do whatever in life, but I will never, ever, ever betray your trust because that is everything to me and that is the basis of my existence your love and your trust i hope you use this app as much as you can and uh, maybe rather than going on things uh, spending time online on things that don't make you a better person that don't help you turn inward <clears throat> you spend your time on this app and doing various rituals and understanding uh, the Vedic uh, practices, as well as deriving strength and beauty and joy from it. So, and a big, big thank you to the team that worked just as hard um, as anybody else. If I was burning midnight oil, they were too. If I was working till 3 a.m., they were too. Um, so it wouldn't be possible without them, and it wouldn't be possible without you. If you really want to help, you can um, at least share this app with your friends. Just so you know, our website, sadhana.app, is also live. <clears throat> we have a beautiful little booklet. I should have had it here. I forgot to bring it, um, which is you can buy a small pack and you can um, give it. It has mantra sadhana and Vedic calendar for the next uh, two years and so on. So... Thank you very much, everybody. I uh, I'm very delighted. Once again, my apologies for the little hiccup we have uh, we had in the middle. I alone was responsible for that. Um, thank you so much, and we'll just do a closing chant. And I hope you go and and use this app and uh, be a little patient because there may be some issues um, in the beginning, but those are teething issues, and we will fix them. Thank you again. Purnamada Purnamidam Purnat Purnamada Chate Purnasya Purnamadaya Purnameva Vashishate Haryom Tatsad 
हरि ओम तत्सद हरि ओम तत्सद थैंक यू मे यू गो ऑन टू डू ब्यूटीफुल थिंग्स विद योर ब्लेसड लाइफ्स योर प्रेजेंस मींस अ लॉट नारायणी नमोस्तु नमोस्तु सूर्याय सहस्ररश्मे सहस्रशाखान्वितसंभवात्मने सहस्रयोगोद्भवभागिने सहस्रसंख्याधारिणे नम यमंडल दीप्ति विशाल रन प्रभं तीव्रमनादिप दारिद्र्यदुखक्षयच पुना तो मं तत्सुर्वरेण्यम यमंडल देवगणसुपूजि विप्रैस्तु तम भावन मुक्ति तेवदेव प्रणमा सूर्य पुना तो मं तत्सुर्वरेण्यम यमंडल ज्ञान घनगम्यम त्रैलोक्यपूज्यम त्रिगुणात्म समस्त तेजोमय दिव्य पुना तो मं तत्सुर्वरेण्यम यमंडल गूढ़मति प्रबोधम धर्म से वृद्धि कुर ते जनापक्षय कारण पुना तो मं तत्सुर्वरेण्यम यमंडल व्यानाशदक्ष यदृग्यजुस्सामसु संप्रगीत प्रकाशित येन च भूर्भुवस्व पुना तो मं तत्सुर्वरेण्यम यमंडल वेद विदो वदी गायती यारण सिद्ध संगा यदिनो योगजुषाच संगा पुना तो मं तत्सुर्वरेण्यम यमंडल सर्वजन पूजि ज्योतिश्चर्यादिमर्त्यलोके यमनादिपम पुना तो मं तत्सुर्वरेण्यम यमंडल विष्णुचतुर्मुखाख्यम यदक्षर पापहरंजना यकालय कारण पुना तो मं तत्सुर्वरेण्यम यमंडल विश्वसृज प्रसिद्ध उत्पत्तिरक्ष प्रलय प्रगलभम यस्जगत्संहरते खिल पुना तो मं तत्सुर्वरेण्यम यमंडल सर्वगत विष्णो आत्मा परंधाम विशुद्ध तत्व सूक्ष्मगम्यम पुना तो मं तत्सुर्वरेण्यम यमंडल वेद विदोपगीत यदिनो योग पथागम्यम तत्सवेद्यम प्रणमा सूर्य पुना तो मं तत्सुर्वरेण्यम सूर्यमंडलसुस्त्र पठेत सतत नर सर्वप विशुद्धात्मा सूर्यलोके महीयते श्री भविष्योत्तरपुराणे श्रीकृष्णाजुन संवाद सूर्यमंडलस्त्र